KD0SGX here. Just doing a quick video of my antenna farm. So I'll show you the dipole. Well, it's actually not a dipole. It, it is. It's a J-pole. And uh, it's on my roof. So there's the J-pole. As you can see, I do have a ferrite choke. Right below it's a little white box down there. And then as it goes down, it goes down into a ground rod with uh, a few other wires as well. And then I also have over here, this just got installed a couple weekends ago. And this is, sorry for the bounce, just got installed a couple weeks ago. This is the Hustler uh, BTV4 with the 80 meters hat. And I am missing one of the spindles there on the, uh, as you can see, one of them broke off, but we'll fix that. And then down here, we've got the uh, base. We've got about 27 to 30 radials, inductor coil there, and some coax seal to, to tune it up. I also have one more antenna, which is on the roof, and we will walk that way. Uh, you can see this is one of the 40 meter legs that attaches to the shed. This is a 2040 fan dipole, and as I back up, you'll see it better. It'll come into view. There's, uh, and, and as for what we're looking at here, the first piece that comes into view is the little, I guess it's a PVC pipe that's on the roof, and that is a 20 meter leg, and then the other 20 meter leg kind of goes to the back. And if you look way up at the top, that is a, uh, as you can see, the pole satellite dish mount with a uh, four, well no, actually that's a one-to-one -one ballon, and uh, 40 meters goes to the shed, and then it also goes to the front of the house, and then 20 meters crosses it. So it's a, it's a fan dipole, and that works for 20, 40, and uh, you know you can tune up a few others if you, if you get lucky. So that is my antenna setup. Thanks.